What's going on guys, this is John with MTC. Welcome back to my channel and to the new viewers out there. As always, welcome. Guys, on my Instagram story last week, I gave you guys an option, which video do you guys wanna see from me? And I did the sneaker collection earlier this week because a lot of you guys wanted that. However, the second option, which was a lookbook, it was very close. It was about 60 to 40%. So I was like, a lot of you guys want a lookbook. So why not give you guys two videos this week, giving you guys both. So in today's video, I'm actually styling a piece that I introduced in the sneaker collection video, which is the Jordan 1 Court Purples. Now this, I've actually gotten a couple requests to do a lookbook. So today, that's what I'm gonna do for you guys. So I've personally seen a lot of lookbooks being done using the Jordan 1s on YouTube, but something that I constantly saw was the person rocking just the same color top as the shoes. So in this case, with the Court Purple, one might rock it with like a purple top, like hoodie or jersey to match the shoes, but I, personally think that's really limiting the way this shoe can be worn and this colorway is more versatile than it seems. So in this lookbook today, not only am I showing you how I would personally rock it, but just what kind of colors can you mess around with to pair up with this purple colorway. So with that being said, we're going to dive straight into it with the outfit number one. Now diving straight into the first look, this right off the bat has to be my favorite look out of the entire lookbook. So we'll start from the bottom and work ourselves up. Now for the pants, I do have a pair of black cargos from PacSun and it's one that I featured multiple different times on this channel and it's just because I wear it that much and I do really, really love this pair. And you can't go wrong with a pair of black cargos in my opinion. And with this one, you can really play around with how the bottom fits. You can um, cinch it in to have that more tapered look, but you can also leave it open to drape over the shoe. And when it comes to Jordan 1, that's what I personally like doing. So that's what I'm doing here. And on top, I am pairing this up with the Cole Buxton warm up tee. And you guys already know how big of a fan I am of Cole Buxton. And if you guys missed that review that I did on this t shirt, I'll make sure to link that down below so definitely go check that out. Now I'm finishing this look off with a light wash denim jacket. I promise you, denim jacket is a must have in your wardrobe around this time of year, going into the spring, going into the summer. You're going to get so much wear out of it. So make sure you have one in your wardrobe. But this is look number one. So jumping into our second look, for the pants, I do have a pair of cargos that you guys really, really seem to love. The black tailor cargos, and it's in this olive green colorway. And I think this really works well with the purple of the shoe. And I know I just said something about how I like the pants to drape over the shoe, but I kind of want to play around with also the cinched in look. And I think this really helps emphasize and bring attention to the shoe. So I did want to mess around with that a little bit. And on top, I do have this Columbia quarter zip jacket. It's a rain jacket, which I think you'll get a lot of wear out of especially in the spring going into like the cooler nights it's very light but uh, i think it makes for a great outerwear and i just really like the color blocking of this jacket and underneath that i am pairing this up with an oversized t-shirt from gymshark and I really, really love the details about this t-shirt, especially that drawstring on the side hanging out at the bottom. And guys, I love that whole layering effect that I'm able to uh, compose with this look. But just overall, color-wise, I just think it's beautiful and it just works so well with that purple colorway for the shoes. Jumping into our last and final look, which is the most simple look out of the entire lookbook. And I just realized that this could also be how to style cargo pants video because I had no idea I was rocking cargo pants for all three looks. But nonetheless, for the bottom here, I have 
the Urban Outfitter cargo pants, which I featured in my style recreation video. And if you didn't see that as well, I'll definitely make sure to link that down below. I just love the color that it carries, the neutral color. And also it's very lightweight, which makes it for a perfect pair for this time of year when it's really, really warm. And although it's a little bit pricey for what it is, I mean, I think it works well with this look. And on top, I am pairing this up with the Fear of God Essential Oversized Tee. This really has been one of my go-to t-shirts. I just love the way it fits and I love the simple design of it. And if you didn't know that yellow colorway is a complementary color to purple. So I decided to kind of play around the general area of that yellow color and put on a tan t-shirt. And I think it worked really, really well. You know, it's simple, but I mean, in the summer, you're really not gonna layer up as much, so I think this is a perfect look for those situations. And that's gonna wrap up the video for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the lookbook. I know you guys were asking for it, and I loved making it. So guys, if there are any other videos that you guys wanna see from me, make sure you guys comment that down below. You guys shoot me a DM on Instagram. I just love listening to you guys and giving you guys what you wanna see. Now, I loved making this video. I loved styling the Jordan 1s. I fell in love with them as I was styling it. So at the end of the day, it might have to be a keep, but but we'll see where that goes guys if you enjoyed the video make sure you give me a thumbs up down below you guys already know how far that goes in getting this video out to many many different people and guys subscribe if you have not already because 1,000 subscribers by the end of this year and we are going to kill that goal we're going to celebrate it together and I can't wait for that so guys make sure you subscribe and lastly if you're not following me over on Instagram at MTC MVMT to check out all the looks that I'm putting together guys make sure you do that as well and that being said if you guys watch this video all the way till the last bit love each and every single one of you and and i'll catch you guys in the next one <laughs>